Farms are already using robots to weed and spray crops. Now they're destined for Queensland's sugar industry. A self-driving tractor being trialled in Mackay could save farmers time and money. Rachel Rieger has more. It looks too good to be true. A tractor working without a driver. It proves the point that you can actually do this. You know, it's not science fiction anymore. It can do it and it does it reliably. In an Australian first for the sugar industry, an autonomous tractor is being trialled in Mackay. The tractor relies on Japanese satellites and GPS signals to direct it where to go. It can level the land, it can uh, fertilise, it can uh, weed spray, it can water. This sort of technology is what we need for the sugar industry. Earlier this year, drones mapped the farm so navigation data could be loaded into the tractor's software. The machine is self-sufficient and drives through rows of crops on its own. Farmers are hoping it'll be more cost-efficient and help remove some of the pressures of farming. The farmer could go to bed at 8 o'clock. That tractor could go round and round the field all night, come out, fuel it up the next morning. The job's done. If we can achieve more productivity with less stress and less people, I suppose it's going to be a good thing. The next step of the trial is to invite about 80 local farmers to see the tractor in action. Being an Australian first, industry experts believe this technology could revolutionise the sugar industry. Experts want to make the technology available to other farmers next year. Rachel Riga, ABC News, Mackay.